My name is Nadine. I'm a mom and a personal trainer. I've been working in fitness for 13 years. What Ramadan means, I cannot uh, summarize it in one word, but mostly it is about sharing. Because like you want to share your love in Ramadan, you share your prayers, you share your dua, you share your food, your meal. The best thing of Ramadan is the nights of Ramadan, the iftar time. But we couldn't do that with the pandemic, with the COVID. It was hard, but it taught us a lot also. It taught us how to find other ways to unite find other ways to connect with our families. But we managed to do it in a different way, which Zoom came in. And uh, it was a bit fun for us because like we used to make sometimes uh, iftar Zoom, like Zoom iftar or like let's uh, have suhoor together. So we tried to, to keep up because as a humans, we are like, we need this unity, we need each other. The essence of Ramadan and like the peace that it comes with it, it calmed me a bit down because I said at the beginning I was a bit resistant. No, no, we, I don't want to accept that COVID is there and I'm not going to be able to see my family, my friends. I'm not going to be able to go to Taraweeh, for example. I'm a, I'm a person that look forward for these things in Ramadan. And I, I surrendered to the idea. So I started talking to myself that no, Nadine, it's there. COVID is here. You have to find another way to stay like emotionally and mentally strong. As for my work, it wasn't easy in the beginning because as a trainer, it's all interactive work in the gym and like you're connecting with people and then suddenly all the gyms closed, nothing, like you couldn't do anything. So here came home workouts and it was the best thing that I've ever done because it opened for me a new uh, line of business, which is the online business and uh, the Zoom sessions, which I've never thought in my life I would do it. Living in Dubai is really a blessing now in, in COVID, but looking at the whole world and like the pandemic is taking a toll on everyone, economically, emotionally, mentally. On the emotional side, like I missed, I missed my friends, I missed the connection, that's for sure. Without faith, I think I would have lost my mind because I wouldn't have been able to uh, conquer my fear, fear about my health, my, uh, my family's health, my mom's health. So if I learned one thing, I learned that faith is very important and that it always works out at the end. Kalaamu and Tubkhir wa Ramadan Kareem.